In our previous video, we showed you how to prune Monstera deliciosa. This video, we're showing you how to propagate it. And we're going to use the stem cuttings that we got from the pruning process. And the best time to do this is in late spring to summer. We've divided the stem up into three pieces. We're going to plant each one of those into a container that's filled with a compost rich potting mix. We're trying two methods of planting the stem cuttings. One, where you plant them horizontally so that they're lying flat on the surface of the potting mix. And the second, where you're planting them vertically so that they're standing up. We'll keep the growing medium moist and we'll keep the plants in a shaded position. We'll water them every week or so with a liquid seaweed fertiliser. This particular cutting's about two months old and it's already starting to send out a new shoot. You can see that just starting to appear here. Down below, it's sending out a new root system as well. We've removed the whole plant from the container. So again, to show you what's going on, we've got our cutting, we have an old aerial root, and here we have a whole new root system developing. Here we have one of the other cuttings, and it's a little bit more advanced. It's already sending out a new shoot. I will grow these plants on in these containers for around about 12 months and then they'll be ready to pot up into other containers or to plant out into the garden. So that's it for propagating Monstera deliciosa. And you can do that with all of the other Monstera varieties as well. Subscribe to the YouTube channel for regular updates on both indoor and outdoor plants. And as always, good luck with your own garden.